You can live a lot of places in 73 years. Christopher Owens is 73 years old and lives alone here at this seniors only apartment complex in Long Beach, California. Uh, my house had became too much for me by myself, you know. I had gotten to a point where I have never really had to look out just for me. I've always had people that I was responsible for. And I moved here, and it is quite a change. Life is slowing down for Christopher, and like in so many places, resources for seniors are limited. According to the Orange County Report on Older Adults, Orange County is not in a position to provide adequate support and care to meet the needs and challenges of this inevitably growing aging population. Our memories ain't what they used to be. One day you feel like you can run around the block and <laughs> next day you're lucky you can get out of bed. If you don't take those under consideration, a lot of problems you have in a building like this here, anxiety, uh, hypertension, uh, we don't need it. Recently, the Church of Christ started holding Bible studies here at the community space of the senior apartment building that Christopher and his neighbors live in. Just taking the time to do this and spend the time, it's just such a blessing, you know, to see see God working through you guys. So when the District of Orange County was preparing for the worldwide Care for Humanity outreach event, and the event's goal was to assist senior citizens, these residents in Long Beach came to mind as the exact population that the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation wants to aid, seniors who need a little help and a sense of community. After picking up seniors, they headed to Walnut High School to experience Care for Humanity, a humanitarian event with the mission to serve the community. The District Supervising Minister of Orange County, California, Brother Jonathan Hamias, opened the event with a study of the words from the Bible to encourage everyone in attendance to continue in doing good works for those in need. community effort to bring wellness to the most vulnerable. Only with a coalition uh, collaboration can you be successful. And uh, having a, a foundation uh, like the Felix Manalo Foundation uh, is very beneficial to our community in Carson and throughout California. Uh, the great work that your church does uh, goes along with uh, the intentions of, of most people. Uh, that's to help other people and, and that uh, fits in really well. So I, I'm glad that collaboration exists. Thank you um, to everyone and on behalf of the California State Senate, it is my pleasure to present this certificate to Brother Elias and the Unemployment uh, Foundation. Um, and thanks to all of you. The direct aid collaboration at this event was grocery packages for each guest, as many as they could carry. For our care packages today, we had several canned goods as well as boxed foods that are um, such as pasta and rice and soups. It was a gesture of assistance that Christopher and the other seniors greatly appreciated. About it, as well as nutritional balance, but we all need to know somebody care about us. Everybody needs that. Senior citizens, they really need our help and care. Especially most of them are by themselves. They are far away from their loved ones. And to meet new people, especially from the church, it gives them inspiration and it brings a smile on their face. The event was a success, leaving Christopher and his neighbors smiling and feeling connected to the Christian culture that's conveyed through the Church of Christ and the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation. Uh, that's love. It's also a transmission of culture and values. Some places I think it's a commandment, do unto others as you have them do unto you. The religious component offers the love, the touch that other agencies really don't have. And then the spiritual part is the love, the hope, um, the faith in humanity, <laughs> that there's still good people out there and despite how bad the world may be and the things that they go through, that there's still people who care. And that um, means a world of Not only 
only are they are we serving them, but we also brought them a sense of community, so that no matter where they go, they know that we are here to help them at any time. To Christopher and his neighbors in his building, they're bringing this sense of community and faith home with them. Absolutely. And our building now is spreading. Hey, I mean, you're kind of special where Christ came to you. <laughs> you know, wow, what more? Can, what else do you need? <laughs> For many of the seniors at this event today, it might be their first encounter with the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation or Care for Humanity, but hopefully not their last encounter with the Iglesia Ni Cristo. From Walnut, California, Tony Marie Hemignano, Worldwide, Lingap Samamamayan, special coverage.